Well, the national holiday it is today, Gandhi Jayanti, celebrated across the country like never before. Perhaps Prime Minister Narendra Modi kick-started his ambitious Swachh Bharat or Clean India campaign from India Gate. And leading from the front in a first, Modi wielded a broom himself outside the Valmiki Basti in Delhi and later outside the Mandir Marg police station, all part of his utopian plan to make India litter-free by 2019. A crowd of thousands comprising school students to industrialists to celebrities cheered Modi as he flagged off the Swachh Bharat or the Clean India mission. Starting his day from the customary visit to Rajghat, Narendra Modi went to India Gate from where he read out that pledge of cleanliness. But then nothing really encapsulates the irony of the clarion call for a Swachh Bharat as the images captured moments after the entire event on camera. The Prime Minister himself wielded the broom on the streets of Delhi earlier today and proclaimed to clean up India in an initiative in which he was joined by actors, citizens and other politicians. But after the speeches were made and the celebrities were gone, take a look at what was left at Rajput, the central arterial ceremonial road that leads up to the India Gate on one side and to Raisina Hill on the other. Heaps of used plastic water containers and polythene bags left strewn all over the VVIP area of the national capital. Take a look at the images which we'll have on your screens in just a moment of the litter that was left behind on Rajput. These are the wrong images. We'll put those images for you up on your screen. The images perhaps a reminder that we may make pledges but are a long and arduous way from changing the mindset of the people. If we could get those images up of Rajput to show our viewers what it was like on Rajput that evening. We'll get those images up for you in a moment. Shapat le ke hum swachh bharat ke sabhyan ko hum sab aage badhayenge. Pradhan mantri ya mantri nahi. 125 करोड़ देशवासी हरेक की जिम्मेवारी है हम इस काम को करेंगे वेल हेडलाइंस टुडे विजिटेड द न्यू दिल्ली रेलवे स्टेशन वेयर क्लीनलीनेस इज डायरेक्टली प्रोपोर्शनल टू व्हाट क्लास यू कैन एक्चुअली अफोर्ड हेडलाइंस टुडे इज आशीष मेरिशी फाइंड्स आउट हाउ मशीन्स वर बीइंग यूज्ड टू क्लीन प्लेटफार्म नंबर 1 एंड अदर वीआईपी एरियाज द रेगुलर प्लेटफार्म्स वर लेफ्ट टू रॉट Swachh Bharat mission is the mission of the Prime Minister. He wants cleanliness in the country. But are the officials maintaining double standards? This is the big question because we are here at New Delhi Railway Station and in a short while from now, the Railway Minister is about to arrive. But what you can see here is, is still there is filth, there is on the railway track, you can see the amount of dirt, it is available here and we can see that the cleanliness drive is only on platform number one where the VIPs are supposed to arrive. We just will just take you to the other side of the railway station where you can see that yes, cleanliness, cleanliness drive is being maintained. You can see, we, you know, with the visuals, you can see it with your own eyes that yes, this side of the platform is very, very clean. The, the sweepers are there, the, the, uh, the housekeeping staff has been maintaining absolute cleanliness on this side. But when you come to platform number two and three, you can see the amount of dirt here. Sir, you know, what we are seeing here is that, you know, on the other side, which is platform number one, the VIPs are supposed to arrive. And that area is pick and span, it's absolutely clean. But when you come to platform number two and three, it's absolutely dirty. Don't you think it is double standard? Absolutely it is. You know, this is to be expected from any government these days. You know, wherever the photo op is supposed to happen, uh, they can, if they really want and apply their mind to it and they really want to make this change and clean things out, they can do it. They can achieve it. But I don't think they have the level of motivation to do more than just, you know, put up a show for the public. And uh, it's a joke. Look, there are two things in this. One is that if we take the new Delhi station, तो यहाँ पर पाँच लाख यात्री रोज आते जाते हैं हम लोग पूरी कोशिश करते हैं कि यात्रियों को अपनी तरफ से एक मैसेज दें कि हमारा साथ दें वो साफ़ सफाई करने में तो अभी जो आपको इम्प्रूवमेंट दिख रहा है वो एक तो ये है कि हम लोगों ने बड़ी फोकस अप्रोच करी है अपने दूसरी जगह से रिसोर्सेज निकाल के हमारे एन हमारे जो वॉल्टियर्स स्काउट्स एंड गाइड्स सिविल डिफेंस सभी को हमने इसमें लगा रखा है तो एक 
शुरुआत है ये एक सोच है बस डबल स्टैंडर्ड्स तो मेंटेन हो ही रहे हैं मतलब तो सफाई दोनों प्लेटफॉर्म्स पे इक्वली होनी चाहिए इनफैक्ट ट्रेन और इन सब सब जगह पे सफाई होती ही रहनी चाहिए They are showing double standards here. They are showing some standards for VIP and they are showing low standards for us. If no, actually uh, there shouldn't be any difference between uh, common people and these VIPs. Everyone should be treated actually the same as we are all Indians and their lives between unity and diversity. Well, Narendra Modi is going about his Clean India campaign with true missionary zeal, inviting people to join the campaign and in turn asking them to invite others. He wants to make it a sort of viral mission launching the Swachh Bharat campaign. Modi invited nine people to join him in making the movement successful. The list comprising many well-known figures includes Sachin Tendulkar, Priyanka Chopra, Salman Khan, Kamal Hassan, Congressman Shashi Tharoor, Reliance Anil Dhirubhai Ambani Group Chief Anil Ambani, Yoga Guru Baba Ramdev, Goa Governor Mridula Sinha and the team of television show Tarak Mehta Ka Ulta Chashma. This even as Modi was joined by Bollywood actor Amir Khan on stage at Rajpath as he addressed the nation on the Clean India Drive. Today, I have the Governor of Goa, Mr. Adhani Amrudula Sunaj Ji, I have the Governor of Bharat Ratna, Sachin Tendulkar Ji, I have the Governor of the Yoga Guru, Baba Ramdev Ji, I have the Governor of the Yoga Guru, मैंने कांग्रेस के नेता श्रीमान शशि थरूर जी को निमंत्रित किया है मैंने श्रीमान कमल हसन जी को निमंत्रित किया है मैंने श्रीमान सलमान खान जी को निमंत्रित किया है मैंने बहन प्रियंका चोपड़ा जी को निमंत्रित किया है इतना ही नहीं तारक मेहता के उल्टा चश्मा उस पूरी टीम को मैंने कहा है कि आप भी इस काम को मेरे मैं निमंत्रण देता हूं करिए